in this tutorial we will learn circle command so here is the circle command you can give C enter also the shortcut of circle command is C enter so you can give directly C and enter then you have to specify center point of circle where you want to create the circle G click the center point then specify radius of circle how much radius you want so the circle of that much radius will be created or you can give from here also circle center radius give the center point give the radius if you click on this arrow there are more options are available you can create a circle by inputting diameter also so center diameter give the center point and give the diameter so circle of specified diameter will be created then you can create circle passing through two points suppose I have two lines here suppose I want to create a circle passing through these these two points so for that I will click here and I will click two point option and then specify first point specify second point so it will create a circle passing through two points so whichever option I click that comes automatically on the top if you want to use the same option you don't have to click again on the arrow you can directly use this so use that option so two point suppose I want passing through these midpoints midpoint midpoint so in this way you can create circle passing through two points next is three point suppose I have a triangle suppose using polyline I will create one triangle suppose I want to create a circle passing through these three midpoints so you can click on it and select three point and now here okay here is the midpoint give the midpoint midpoint and midpoint so same way you can create passing through these three points three point give first point second point only and third point so in this way you can create circle passing through three points same way if you want to create circle using tan tan radius if you want to create a circle touching to two circles suppose if I have two circles here this is the first circle enter to repeat the command and this is the second circle suppose I want one circle touching to these two circles so I can use tan tan radius so give the first tangent point second tangent point and the radius so in this way you can create a circle touching to two circles same way you can create circle touching two lines also suppose I have this one line and this second line suppose I want to create a tangent circle touching to these two lines so again tan tan radius click first tangent point second tangent point and give the radius so in this way you can create circle touching to two lines also or you can create circle touching line and circle also suppose I want to create a circle touching this circle and this line so same using tan tan radius you can do that so specify first tangent point second tangent point and give the radius so in this way it will create a circle touching to line and circle also so in this way you can create circle using tan tan radius option and last is tan 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 that means object touching to three tangent to three objects suppose uh, tan tan radius I want to create a circle touching to this three circles so I will take first circle second circle third circle so in that way you can create it or basically this option is more useful when suppose there is a some rectangle is there so if I want to create a circle touching to this three lines so at that time you can use tan 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 first tangent point second third tangent point and remaining thing you can trim it so you can create the desire 
object so at such a position it is more useful and same way two point is useful if you want to increase the length by the radius so at that time if so three point is useful when you want to keep the length same rectangle length same but you, if you want to increase the length by radius distance then you can use two point option actually first point second point so in this case rectangle length will be increased by radius distance and you can trim the unwanted objects so in this way you can create a slot so at the time of creating a slot you can use three point or two point as per your requirement and if you want to create a line tangent to two circles then you can use the line command and to specify the tangent point you just press shift button and right click shift plus right click and click on tangent and click on the circle and here also i want the tangent again shift right click tangent and click on the circle and press enter so in this way you can create a tangent line to two circles same way you can create a tangent line tangent to one circle also line command suppose from this center point i want to create a tangent to this circle shift right click tangent click on the circle and press enter to come out so in this way you can create tangent line also tangent to two circles so thank you we'll stop here